Drake is the nickelback of rap, every song sounds exactly the same. If you played every one of his songs in a loop, you wouldn't be able to figure out where one song ends and the next one begins, hey. Don't lump Nickelback in with him, at least they threw some effort into their music. I'd rather listen to enthusiastic bad music than mediocre music from a guy who thinks he's a genius. I have a friend whose two favorite artists are Drake and Nickelback. My boss hates Drake. And every time Drake plays at work from someone's phone, he would make a comment. Last time he said it to me, it was while I was playing Kendrick's Maad City. I imagine the original poster knows Drake's music about as well as my boss. My position on Drake is neutral. But he has has some of widest range of song styles and flows rappers have produced. This says nothing of technical skills or content or popularity, nor is it a comment on greatness. But listen to 5AM in Toronto then Passion Fruit, then the motion and say it all sounds the same. It just doesn't. If you want to rip Drake down for some reason, go for it. But take an avenue that makes sense, this reminds me of people saying Eminem is the best rapper to ever exist. Or a terrible rapper. If you're somewhat analytical of rap as a whole, you could never say either is true. This isn't original you just got it off of Anthony Fantana's unpopular opinions. You wouldn't be able to figure out where one song ends and the next one begins. Laughs in Pink Floyd. Dude keep up with the times. Imagine dragons are the new Nickelback. They're so shit they make Nickelback sound like virtuosos. It's okay to dislike Drake but to say all of his music sounds the same is factually untrue. He's literally known for being versatile. And yes, I know what factually means. Wow, no one has ever made me feel bad for Nickelback before. Please tell me how Hotline Bling and a track like Nonstop or Mob Ties sound the same. This isn't an unpopular opinion, just a crude generalization from someone who's afraid to admit they like a mainstream artist. Drake's song mostly suck but they definitely sound different. I don't follow him but I think he's alright. I'm nostalgic for his first album, Thank Me Later, because it came out when I was in middle school. Dude. All the Right Reasons was a great album. What came before and after wasn't nearly as good, but you'd be lying if you said that wasn't a decent album start to finish, but I like Nickelback. His stuff with Young Money is classic. Name a classic Nickelback song. Are you insane? Let's just take three of his most famous songs. Hotline Bling. Money in the Grave. Started from the Bottom. Do any of them sound even remotely alike? Nope. Never liked his music one bit, no some people do. I love rap but of the underground variety, which all the good stuff is currently located. I don't why everyone hates on Nickelback they make pretty good music. No come on. I'm not a fan of Drake's or anything, but Nickelback had like two to three singles. Drake's had a dozen, he's been in the zone for so long, He's certainly influential. Not comparable. I love Drizzy, and most of his catalog is actually pretty dope. His radio overplayed songs, One Dance, Hauk, God's Plan etc., are pop friendly to the max of course and pretty overproduced, but the dude has fucking raw songs. His If You're Reading This It's Too Late mixtape is generally considered his best work. On Pound Cake he outraps fucking Jay-Z, in his defense, his verse is hella weak. And even more life has some bangers. Dude can spit of course, but those songs getting the least radio airplay. On a music theory level, Drake is okay. He mixes it up enough, stylistically. I just can't stand his voice. But that ain't hurting his bank account, is it? Nickelback has the same chord progressions in every song they put out. Which is fine, the entire punk movement did too. That's nothing new with rock music, but it was just such bland studio rock with no energy. Some people liked it, cool. Neither of those acts are for me, not a baby. Drake is really not that good, I only listen to real rappers like NF and Logic. I wonder if Op has heard of Joyner Lucas, he's bringing real rap back. 
I genuinely hate Drake because of his shit songs. He doesn't even rap about actual things. All he talks about is getting money and bitches and how much stuff he has compared to someone like Eminem who raps about society and life or someone dumber such as YNW Melly who raps about the life of a gangster, or a guy in the hood, e.g. Murder on My Mind where he raps about accidentally killing one of his friends because he was on itch.